Hello, my name is Brian Kemple. I hold a PhD in philosophy from the University of St. Thomas in Houston, Texas, and I am the founder of Continuum Philosophical Insight. Now, I started Continuum because after four years of teaching in a university setting and two years on the academic job market, I realized that there has to be a better way. A better way of teaching people who really want to learn that difficult to acquire habit of philosophical thinking. Most of the students that I had in my university courses simply were not interested. They were there simply because they had to be. Now, I do think that I reached some of these students. I think I was able to get through them, and I think a fair percentage ultimately did come to appreciate what it was I was trying to teach them. But it was far more of a struggle than it should have been. And most of the students remained content to simply do the bare minimum, if even that. At the same time, I found the structure of obtaining employment and practicing one's profession as a philosopher within the university to be a structure which actively worked against real philosophical development, both for myself and for my students. So I began to step away from university life and look for new ways to bring my training and my talents to the world at large. And what grabbed my attention was the opportunities afforded by the internet. Gradually, this opened up into new ways of thinking about how technology impacts our lives and specifically how it impacts our relations with one another. Through this thinking, I ultimately came to realize that we are, for the most part, not taking advantage of what the internet can contribute to our lives and can contribute to our interpersonal relations, especially when it comes to learning. And through all of these realizations taken together, the idea was germinated for Continuum Philosophical Insight. And so here I am, striving, as my tagline suggests, to bring thinking beyond the academy, beyond academia, and to do so through digital media. Now, I think this requires not only breaking through the walls of the ivory tower, but avoiding reduction to being talking heads or vain ideologues or mere street philosophers who teach people rhetorical tricks and sophistical argumentation techniques, but rather to really engage myself and others in a constant philosophical habit of critically reflecting upon our world, upon our experiences, and most of all, upon our own thinking. Now, while I prefer to do this in one-on-one -on -one or small group situations, and I am currently building a platform to increase this kind of accessibility, I also like to spread philosophical thinking in public-facing media through short videos which explain specific concepts, through articles, through books, and through a new project where I am using digital means to revive the scholastic practice of the disputed question. And so your financial support will make these public-facing practices possible and will furthermore allow me to pursue more and better ways of bringing thought outside the academy. So there's nothing left to say at this point other than thank you for your time in listening, thank you for your attention, and thank you most of all if you decide you would like to become a patron.